You can. Justice Department, welcome. Welcome. Someone's made contact with him. Thanks for coming to meet me. Don't mention it. Chico, Jackie's leaving the airport. name is Jackie Chan. Three years ago, he skipped to the States after he was let out on bail. A few days back, he made contact with the Justice Department. This is Mr. Kwok from Justice. Jackie Chan's a member of the Shadow Gang from Los Angeles. Giving himself up? He's turned crime witness and needs protection. Huh. He must have fallen out with the Los Angeles crowd. Hmm. We're not sure about that. However, he claims that he can provide us with a list of all the Shadow members here in Hong Kong. If what he says is true, then we can clean up the whole lot. And early this morning, Mr. Kwok's agents went to the airport and picked Jackie Chan up. But someone held up their car, and Jackie Chan was kidnapped. Could the local shadows be behind the kidnap? That's why you're here. We've got to find that out. Huh. How are we supposed to do that? During the gunfight, one of them was killed. He had this on him. The address may be of some help to you. Mr. Kwok has asked that we handle this, as he is an important witness. There's no time to lose. Why isn't this case being handled by CID? The shadow gang's everywhere. There is a possibility CID's been compromised. If there was a leak, years of work will go down the drain, both here in Hong Kong and in L.A. Yoli, Rosa, sorry we got so little. I want you to get onto this right away. Right. Jackie Chan, so this is where they brought him. Come on, move! Up there. Come on, let's go. Hmm. Hey, hang on. What do you want with me? Hey! Hey! You're coming with us. Who the hell are you? They call us the Blue Angels. We're a special operations unit. 
Chico, someone's managed to get Jackie Chan out. Do you know who the hell they were? Just two girls. Don't know where they're from. Get everyone on it. I want Jackie Chan. Right. Jackie, welcome to Hong Kong. Glad to be back. Your people are very efficient. Especially these two sex kittens. You've got good taste. <laughs> You're a member of the Shadows. Why did you turn them in? Well, I crossed another gang in the L.A. Chinatown. In order to avoid a gang war, the Shadows decided to throw me to the wolves. As they'd screwed me, there was nothing else I could do. Jackie, what about this list? Hey, you can't have it right now. Why not? Because I got news that the head of the Southeast Asian Shadows is here now. I'll use it as bait to bring him out. Then cut off his head. Who is this man? I'm not sure if he's the right man. Because he's not on my list. Guy's clever. But surely you must know his name. His name is Don Chu. You mean the guy who owns all the nightclubs in town? Hmm. This guy's definitely connected with the Shadows. It's said that most of his hostesses are illegal immigrants from mainland China. I've also heard that he sends girls overseas as hookers. You mean he's a white slaver, too? Jackie, it's too risky for you to go off and get him yourself. Why don't you give us the list and we'll handle it ourselves? That's right. It's not that simple. You got no chance if they find out you're cops. If Jackie insists on doing this, why don't we just let him try it? Mr. Kwok, for his own safety, it's better if we put him under 24-hour surveillance. You agree with that? I think that's the best idea. Okay, then. Jackie, but remember, you must cooperate with these girls. Sure. That'll be a pleasure. A real pleasure. <laughs> Rosa, take Jackie to the safe house in Sheko and stay with him. Mm-hmm. Yoli, go check out this guy, Choose, see what you can find. Mm. This way. Oh. Hi! Hi! This is our manager. Go oh. in. How are you? You're the boss, right? I'm Yoli. I'm glad to meet you. It's my pleasure. Hey, all right, all right. That's in. enough. All right, all right. What can I do for you? Uh, I want to apply for the... Hey, yeah, I know. All the girls coming in here want a job. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Okay, you seem to have all the qualifications we're looking for. This company offers a lot of benefits. If you cooperate with us, I guarantee you'll make over $50,000 a month. Huh? Wow, 50000 for singing plus benefits as well? What's that? Singing? That's right. I want to be a singer. Hey, this chance. company is hiring hostesses at the moment. We don't need any singers. I'm very sorry. Please, sir, please give me a chance. Oh, I'm look, a good I'm telling singer. you, we're really? not hiring any singers. I'm sorry. Oh, believe me. No, no, I no, really no, no, no. What's going on here? Please. I can't, please. Oh, hello, boss. This girl wants a job as a singer. It's all right. Uh, now, boss, I'm a very good singer. Really. Please give me a job. I'll bring in a lot of customers. If you don't believe me, I'll show you right now. Okay, I'll prove it to you. You don't like that? And how about this? One, two. One, two. Hey, big spender. Spend a little time. Yeah. Do you like this? I know others. Woo, 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 woo. Come stand by me. Woo, 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 woo. I'll always be. Woo, 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 woo. Woo, 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 woo. woo. Michael, what do you think? She's funny. We can give her a try. Hmm. She can start tomorrow. Right. Thanks a lot. It's OK. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Hey, 
sexy. Ain't you here to protect me? You having problems? Yes, and it's serious. You're so far away, how are you going to protect me? So what do you want? You know what I mean. I just want you to be a little more friendly, that's all. Let's keep the party clean, hmm? What are you doing? Making a call. Now listen to me. Whatever you do here, you check with me first. You got that? Hey. Hey. For you. Hello? Who is it? Don't you recognize my voice? Jackie. What is it? If you want that list of names, you get a million bucks together for me. Huh. A million bucks, no problem. You can have it. But I'd like to know who those two young women are. Never mind that. Just remember, no damn tricks. Okay. So when do we meet? I'll call you. Chico, who is this Jackie? Somebody I used to work with. Then he went to the States. Got himself in a lot of shit and had to come back. He's a snake. If he's really got a list of the members, there's no way we can touch him. The only thing we can do now is pay him off. I know how to deal with him. you fancy her. Hey, miss, that was great. <laughs> Terrific. Thank you. <laughs> 
Hey, sexy, have a drink with us. I'm sorry, I don't drink when I'm working. Come on, just the one it won't hurt. We're not good enough? No, I don't mean that. Then okay then, come on, have a drink with us. This is Sammy. Waiter, give this lady a drink. I'm sorry, I really can't drink with you now. What is this? Nobody says no to us. You want to keep working here, don't you? That's not what I mean, but I just... No more stories. Drink it up. Come on, drink uh, it. Uh, Come on, drink up. Uh, That's all right. I'll clean it up. Hey, listen. You're drunk. You better leave now. <laughs> Who the hell are you? You just want a girl? There's plenty of others. Hey, screw you. If Sammy wants his chick, then he can have her. Oh, that's no problem. Why don't we discuss this? And I'll bring her along later. That sounds a lot better. Right. Let's go over there. Hmm. You see, you gotta sweet talk these girls. There's no use trying to force them, see? Are you trying to impress her? Ted, the shipment will be here tomorrow. I want you to go and pick it up. Be careful, all right? Got it, Chico. Okay, bye-bye. Hello? It's Ted. The goods are here. See you tomorrow. What do you want? Get out of here! What are you doing? This is my bed. Go back to your room. Go on, get out of here. Okay, I'll go. <laughs> <coughs> Don't be stupid. <coughs> Whoa. Wow. Hey, you're really something else. Just get out. Come on, take it easy. <coughs> no. No. <coughs> hey, no. Please, I've had enough. Hmm. Listen to me. You try that one more time, and I promise you, you'll spend a long time in the hospital. Hmm. Dolly, give you a lift. No thanks. I'll get a cab. It's late. There aren't many. Not at this hour. <laughs> Thank you. So, where do you live? Braemar Hill Road. Well, I must thank you, Michael. We often get people like that in the club. You'll soon get used to it. <laughs> no, I wanted to thank you for getting me the job in the club. It was your word that got me in. But you're a talented singer. It seems that Mr. Chu respects your opinion. Hmm. That's because I've never let him down. Hello? Daddy wants to see you at once. It's urgent. I'm sorry. I've got to go back to the club at once. Driver, take this lady home. Mm. Hill Road.
What is this? Well, to love somebody, you've got to show it sometimes. I'm warning you, dear. If I catch you with that cheap little slut again, I'm going to cut her tits off. Is this why you brought me back? That's all I want to say. You better go in and see Daddy at once. Yes, Don. You wanted to see me? A girl committed suicide in the house. Take care of it. Right. Hey, another thing. A customer from Europe is coming. You know what to do. Yes, Don. Hmm. Open the door. Ah, oh, right. Michael. Where is she? Over there. Take it easy. We don't know how it happened. We never took our eyes off her. You listen. If this happens again, it's your head. Right. found Jackie yet? We looked everywhere, still haven't found him. What about the police? Our contact inside came up with nothing. The Attorney General's got it screwed down tight. I don't care what you have to do. You better find him fast. L.A. is pushing me. Okay, Don. Hey, Chico. Mm -hmm. Our shipment from Bangkok was ripped off by the dragons. You better tell him about it. I found out we got a leak in the organization. He's taking money from the Dragons. Who is it? Teddy Chan. You got any proof? I told him to handle this one. No one knew the time apart from him. I ran a check on his bank accounts. There was a big deposit. I want more evidence. I've had him followed round the clock. Now then, Don, what do you want to do about the Dragons? They'll regret it. You've been with the department a long time? About two years. Yolly, let me introduce you. This is Amy from the Attorney General's office. She was recommended by Mr. Kwok. Hi. Ha Hi, Amy. Welcome to the Blue Angels. Good to be here. Yolly, for the time being, she can stay in Rose's room. Can you take her over there? Right. Oh, oh, I can manage. It's okay. Thank you. <sighs> this is Rose's room. Make yourself at home. Thanks a lot. This is much better than my last place. I've heard quite a lot about the Angels. 
Hope it was good. So then, you've been working with Mr. Clark. That's right. I was with him two years. But it was boring. It wasn't enough action for me, so I'm happy to be working with you girls. Uh -huh. Ah. He's a very nice-looking boy. Is he your son? Yes, that's my boy. What grade's he in now? I've already lost him. And your husband? Soon after the bull was born, we were divorced. Amy, I'm sorry. Ah, that's right. I just made some mango pudding. Would you like to try some now? No, thank you. If you need anything, you just call. I'll leave you to unpack. What am I going to tell Mr. Chu? You borrowed money from us. Mm. I'd rather work here until it is paid off. Is that possible? <laughs> you must be kidding. You owe so much, you'll never pay it off here. You'll have to go. Go back to work. <laughs> Sandy, what's wrong? Giving you trouble, are they? They're sending me to the Middle East. I'd rather die. Middle East? They're forcing you to go? What a surprise! <laughs> if you need something, just give me a call. No need to come. I didn't want to discuss it over the phone. Oh, I see. Come into the office. Come on in. <laughs> Go bring us some hot tea. That's okay. <laughs> I want you to look at this. <laughs> what is it? Huh? I knew that sooner or later you'd come around here for me. I'm sorry about this. <laughs> 
Why did you sell us out to the opposition? We treated you real good. Sure! But never as good as you, Chico. All this time and I'm still a damn runner. For the last 20 years, I've risked my life for you. And what have I got? I got squat. So if somebody offered you a territory, and if you were me, what would you do? Come on. Why not use your brains? You think you can trust the dragons? That they'd be that generous? Now you're a double-crosser. Suppose you don't need me to tell you. You'll carry that stink forever. Not that you'll live that long. You're already dead. <laughs> we'll see who goes down first, you or me. Take him out! Chico, no, no, Chico, no, come on, Chico, we're good buddies, Chico. Didn't I tell you? You're already dead. <laughs> You lie low in Macau for a while. Oh, uh, no. No. Please don't. Don't so you. I see. Uh, Running off to Macau. Why didn't you ask me? I'm sorry. I'll take it back to the club. Uh, Michael, it's not his fault. I, I asked him to get me out. I'm sorry. I'll do what you want. Get your luggage out. I'm sorry about this, Michael. Don't shoot. Please don't shoot. I'm sorry. Listen, I don't want to see you again. If I do, I'll blow your head off. Go! <laughs> For a few days. Oh, I haven't seen her myself for a few days. But hostesses move around a lot. It's not unusual. <laughs> Maybe she's left. Yoli. Uh -huh. uh, excuse me, Yoli. Well, there's a customer. He wants you to go and join him at his table. I'm sorry. I never sit with the customers. Well, I know that. But he insisted. He said he admires you. He says you're a very good singer. And he's sure that you want to see him. All right, then I'll be with him in a minute. Mr. Lowe, this is Yoli. I'm Robert. Glad you could come. Glad to meet you. Please, have a seat. All right, then, please excuse me. Later on, pretend you're going to the washroom. The manager's office is next to it. Check out the files. Just leave it to me. Oh. Mister, want the gents? Uh, uh, yes. Through there. Oh, oh, great, thanks.
Oh, no. Now, no, don't go away. We have a great future together. I'll give you a promotion. Oh. What were you doing in there? Lucy. Mm. Why'd you want to see me today? Tell me what happened last night. Oh, do you mean the young man who started the fight in the club last night? Who is he? What did he want? He said he was an admirer. I've never met him before. What's wrong? You don't believe me? All right, Yoli. Whatever it was, it mustn't happen again. I might as well tell you this. I owe Mr. Chu. I won't cover for you again. Nice place. Sit down a minute. I'll call Rosa. Okay. It's okay. I'm coming. I heard your car drive up, so I put some coffee on the stove. Here you are. Let me introduce you. Rosa, Amy. Hello. I've heard a lot about you. Welcome to the Blue Angel. It's a real pleasure. Hey, let's sit down. Rosa makes good coffee. Really? Having a party? Oh, he's the guy we're protecting, Jackie Chan. Yet another pretty girl's arrived in the household to protect me. Hey, watch your mouth if you don't want trouble. Only joking. Hey, give me a cup of coffee. You crippled? All right, I'll get it myself. Oh. Hey, the guy's a woman chaser. He came out to me last night and I had to hit him.
Were you in Hong Kong three years ago? You killed a woman and a boy and you're wrong. Who are you? <laughs> I told you he's girl mad. Amy, oh, flesh wound and I survived, but my son died. It wasn't me that pulled the trigger. It was Chico. He's the one who killed your son. I don't care. You're with him anyway. Come on, you must calm down. If you kill Jackie Chan now, what are we supposed to tell Quark? If you want revenge, you should look for Chico. If you want, I can help you get him out in the open. Just shut up, you idiot. Now, if you want to get your revenge, you can have him when we've wrapped this case up. But let him be for the time being, okay? You can do whatever you like then. A deal? That's right. So you can chop him up if you want to. We don't care what you do with him, right? Mm. Uh -huh. Chico, it's not Jackie. Hello? One million bucks is waiting for you. Just where and the time. Huh. I've changed my mind. I want two million bucks. And I deal with your boss. You must be out of your mind, man. What do you mean you want to deal with the boss? Don't you know I'm in charge here? You know what I mean. He has to come by himself. Otherwise, I'll turn the list over to the goddamn cops here. You don't want that. You just want money. We'll give you what you want. Do as I say. I'll meet you next Monday at the Upper Reservoir. Be there. Hey. Well then, so what did Chico say? Will the boss be there? Hmm. Don't know yet. But I suggest you better ask your superiors to send more men to cover me. What's that? Am I not good enough? Hey, sure, you're wonderful. But there'll be a lot of them, you know. So we'd better be prepared. <laughs> oh. Oh. Just watch your hands. <laughs> Damn bitch. So what time did he say he wanted to meet? Next Monday. Get ready for him and kill him on sight. But Don, we can't do that. He's still got the list with him. I talked to L.A. already. Jackie lied. He hasn't got any list. Right. Good luck. Thanks. Why didn't your boss send more people to cover us? This is too dangerous. Let's go, you coward. Hey, 
Where's Chico? Chico's too busy today. So does that mean he doesn't want the name list? Stop lying. We know there's no list. Kill the asshole. No! <laughs> the list from Jackie, yet they tried to kill him. There's something very odd here. Perhaps that was another one of Jackie's tricks. I suspect that Jackie lied and he doesn't have a list at all. He was only using it to try to extort money from Chico. If I find out that's true, I'm going to kill the bastard. Even if he was lying, there's nothing much we can do about it. We'll fix him up later. He mustn't get away. Yoli, what about the club? Any progress yet? I've come up with nothing so far. Get on it. We need results quick. The top floor is on my back. I'll get right on it. Right, Yoli. May I introduce you to Mr. Otto? He's from the Middle East. <laughs> oh, nice to meet you. <laughs> mm. Come on, everyone. Let's have a drink. There you go. Cheers. Mr. Otto's going back to the Middle East in a few days. Yoli, why don't you keep him company? He could well give you a blank check for your time. I don't know what you mean. Ah, you're a singer because you want to make money, right? One night with him could keep you for six months. You better think about it. Mr. Chu, I'll do whatever you want. <laughs> Clever girl. Mr. Otto, mm -hmm. no ping pong. What do you mean, no ping pong? No ping pong means no problem. Oh, no problem, huh? Yeah, right. No problem. Oh, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hey, don't be in such a hurry. We have a long night. Have a drink first. No ping pong? Okay, no ping pong. Hiya, baby. 
Want a party? Uh, hey, you want to have some fun with uh, us? Uh, out of my way! Uh, on, sweetheart. We can have a good time wanna together. Disco? Hey, where are you going? Take your hands off me! Hey, come on! Oh. Hey! Right, Yoli? Small world. Can I take you home? Come on. Yoli, you better not work in the club anymore. Why? Mr. Chu's daughter, Lisa, sent those two guys to check you out. You must be careful. What about you? What are you going to tell Mr. Chu about this? I'll tell him nothing. Now. This time, you have to pay your own camp fare. <laughs> hey! These roses are for you. Thank you. Now your cover's blown. And that club was the only lead we had to go on. All our work's wasted. But there must be another way. You got any ideas? There is one thing we can do. Watch that Middle East guy. He's here for business, which means that they'll be trying to ship girls out very soon. This guy could be the break that we're looking for. Hmm. Yes, Mr. Otto. I would like to see you tomorrow. I will send someone to pick you up. But before we deal, I want you to do something for us first. It'll be good for the both of us.
Are you sure that this girl is a cop? I don't care who she is. I have to kill her anyway. Kill her? Oh, that would be a shame. Take Mr. Otto back to his hotel. How about the goods? I can't wait around here much longer. Let me finish up first, and then I'll set up a meeting with you. Is that okay? All right. Huh. You were lucky you got away last time. But this time you're not getting out of here alive. My friends are waiting for me. If I'm not back in 10 minutes, then this whole place will be crawling with cops. Get out while you still can. You don't frighten me, you bitch. Go to hell. to traders.
I don't care what you have to do. I want Yoli dead. You've got 24 hours. Kill you. Is it because I killed Don Chu's daughter? That's right. I take his money. I must do the job. Right. If you think you're doing the right thing, then go ahead, shoot. Where's your family? They're all dead. Killed in Vietnam. Oh. I came here five years ago. Don Chu took me in. Is that why you work for a man like that and risk your life for him? You don't understand. I owe him. You must quit this kind of life or you're bound to get killed someday. I'm a killer. I live by the gun. I'll die by the gun. It's your life. You can control your own destiny. You can do whatever you want. Come on, why don't you make a clean break and try to start a new life? It's too late. There's too many ghosts. I can't change what I am. That's the way of the world. Is Anita there? What? She's not in?
What is it? Get up, asshole! <laughs> down, Amy. Put that thing away. Hey, what's he done? Amy, take it easy. That's right. We got a deal, remember? Don't worry, I'll help you get Chico. All right, then. Give him a call now. Okay. Okay, I'll call him now. Jackie, what do you want? Well, I'd like to see you tomorrow. Tell me where. The house in Chartier. Hey, I'm gonna try to cup my coffee. Oh, thank you. It's real bitter. Want more sugar? That's okay. Thank you anyway. You're welcome. This is it. You go and get Chico out in the open. You kidding? The guy could kill me. <laughs> but you got no choice. Go and get Chico out or I'll kill you right here. Go on. Call him. Chico! I'm here! Come on out! I'm here! Come out now, Chico. I've got the list with me. Don't you wait! You're just lying. There is no list. Come on. Don't you. Don't kill me! No! 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 You're a cop. It's not your business who I am. Today, you're gonna die for killing my boy. I don't know what you're saying. You remember three years ago you gunned down a woman and a little boy in Yin Long? I've killed so many people, I don't remember them all.
kill him. Let it go. Uh, Amy, if you kill him now, we've got nothing left to go on. No, Amy. Don't do it. Stop. No, don't. Amy, you can't do it. Let go. I'll finish the bastard. Right. If you want to kill him, kill me first. Chico, who is the boss? Don Chu is the head of the local shadows, isn't he? Who's Don Chu? I don't know him. Come on, if you cooperate and tell us what you know, it's to your advantage. The prosecution will do a deal. I know nothing. So you don't even know who you're working for. Then you're no good to us. Sorry, I did try to help. Amy, this guy's no damn use to us. You can have him. Uh, hang on. Uh, uh, I'll cooperate. Hey. Okay, so who is the head of your organization? The head of the shadows is... Over there! Leave it! I know who it is. Look, Michael, I want to know, why you killed Chico? I take the money, and I must do the job. So Joe asked you to kill him. Was it because he was afraid that Chico would expose him? What are you talking about? Chu is the head of the local branch of the Shadow Gang. I don't know. Chu is a goddamn gangster. The law will get him one day. Why do you keep protecting him? I can't control what he does. All I know is I owe him. I must repay him. And I've sworn that no one will touch him. And what if one day I have to arrest him? What do you do? I'll stop you. But you can't take on the whole of the police force. I know. You think it's worth it? I live by the gun. I'll die by the gun. Nothing more I can say. These are the girls. Please check them. Right. Hmm. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> She's nice. What's happening? They're all inside the house, but there's a lot of them. Otto. You see, they're all very beautiful girls. You'll make a great deal of money. That's great. <laughs> You're an animal. 
devil, you bastard! I hope you rot in hell! Huh? <laughs> I don't have to hurt you now. I tell you, your time is coming soon. <laughs> no ping pong, no problem. It's the end of the road for you. We got you now. The place is surrounded. You're under arrest now. Come on! <laughs> I've been around too long to be taken by a chit of a girl. Drop the gun. Let's go. You go that way, okay? He's getting away.
Stop it. Jody, are you all right? I'm okay. Gun, you'll die by the gun. <laughs> 